Good evening, my beautiful collective. Welcome to Divine Healing Tarot, where shit gets very real and we do not edit a darn thing. All right, people, let me see. Check and see if it's good. Let's see. All right, move that out of the way. Yes, um, we don't have a Starbucks here, so what I decide to do is I make my own. As you can see, we have Starbucks. <laughs> mm. Oh my God, that's so good. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and knock out some Libra today. All right, Libra. Um, things can be moving a little bit slow for you, Libra. Okay, you are going through an ascension period. Mm. Feeling as if life just keeps taking you backwards. <laughs> All right. For Libra. For Libra. What do we have, Spirit, for Libra? For my beautiful Libras. What do we have for Libra? For Libra. For Libra. What do we have for Libras? Libra. For Libras, what do we have for Libra? Spirit, for Libra, Libra. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth it is in heaven. Give us this day, Lord, our daily bread. Forgive all of our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Only us not into temptation, but deliver us all from evil. Because thy is the kingdom and the great glory of heaven forever and ever. Amen. Okay, Libra. Things could be seeming like they're going backwards at this time, Libra, okay? There could be some uh, looking at old photographs, you know, wanting to reminisce about the past, okay? Outdated thinking, um, maybe over a person that you were engaged to. Um, there is looking at photographs here. Maybe if you weren't engaged, then there was some kind of commitment, okay, partnership. All right, um, let's see. What else do we have? Stabbed in the back, okay? Maybe you cannot get over the fact that you were stabbed in the back by this person. All right, um, and then we also have heartbroken and Cupid's arrow. So I do see a death and a rebirth here. Um, this person is missing you, but I'm really feeling like you need to put the, uh, the last nail in the coffin, that's what I'm hearing. Okay, and um, there is something about coming into union with a divine counterpart. So as soon as you decide to let this go, I'm hearing, let it go, let it go until the great unknown. Let it go, let it go. Okay, there's no reason why I did not pick up coffee. Okay, coffee coffee <laughs> okay meeting con conversating okay we need to leave this broken um past in the past the person that sabotaged us the narcissist okay we are coming into uh coming out of i mean the mercury retrograde coming here on the 14th god it is such a countdown for me because mercury is kicking my butt Mercury in retrograde can really kiss my ass this, this month, okay? This time around, I'm like, I'm not even joking. I cannot stand Mercury. I have not been able to get out no readings. And the readings I do get out, they're only half-ass readings because my camera just decides to stop, my battery decides to die, or I run out of memory. It's like I cannot catch a break. Anyways, um, Libra, you could also be feeling the same exact way. You just feel like you cannot catch a mother monkey break. Okay, but it's okay because we are up, we're feeling uplifted. This is coming in the future. Um, there's going to be something about um, meeting up with somebody and having a conversation, maybe over some coffee or some lunch. Okay, this person could also um, be wanting to come into a business contract with you, talking business or a good business idea. Okay. Um, yeah, also I'm hearing sage and cleanse your home. Sage and cleanse your home with the cleansing wand here all right um what else do we have for libra for libra what else do we have for libra Woo. 
seduction, flirting, dating, hooking up, temptation, third party, influence. Okay, it is time, Libra. It is time to leave that third party energy alone. That is what I'm hearing. As soon, that's what this is that you're needing to move away from. In order to level up, Libra, you have got to leave a third party energy alone. That could be addictions. That could be sex addictions. That could be drug addictions, alcohol addictions. Um, there's some kind of addiction that we have here that we need to drop, Libra. Um, may that also be ego death. Okay, I'm hearing as well a death to ego, death to old ways, old ways of thinking. Okay, it says here out for the cassette. It says um, outdated thinking and um, con conduiting or whatever, replaying events over and over in our head. Okay, and it is time. It is time to transform. And like I said, last nail in the coffin. Okay, do we need to straight up say not today, Satan? Not today. Okay, not today. You're not going to fuck with me today. You're not going to keep me in this outdated thinking. It is time to transform like the butterfly and evolve. Okay. Um, also, I'm seeing here also healing childhood trauma. Healing childhood trauma issues for Libra. All right. That your love life will benefit as you forgive your parents. I'm hearing. Okay. All right. For Libra. For Libra. What do we have? Well, the hair font wanted to come out and the putting the burdens down and love. Okay, so love is coming in. You do have somebody that is in the past, though, um, stalking you, looking over old photos, and just uh, straight up being a weirdo. <laughs> weirdo! We got a weirdo alert. Weirdo alert. Yes, um, this person could also be driving past your house, honking horns, okay, or um, just being weird. Okay, we don't like weirdos. No, we don't. We do not like weirdos. All right. Yeah, it could also be somebody driving by your work. Okay, or at your work. Okay, I'm leaving that out and it's in reverse. Yes, uh, in reverse too could also mean that you're having problems at work. Um, you're also having problems with people listening to you. You're having problems with people not taking you seriously at work. And this is putting you in like a self-sabotage um, energy. And it's because you need to work on your inner child. Okay. You're not always going to be in control, Libra. Okay. That's what I'm also hearing. You're not always going to be in control. And I know that I'm going to piss off a lot of people with this reading. But you know what? I'm sorry. I have to say what's in the cards. All right. I'm sorry. You can unsubscribe from my channel. No problem. But I have to say what's on my mind and what's in the cards. All right. Please for Libra. For Libra. Yeah, there's a lot of things hidden in illusion. There's a lot of things hidden in illusion, okay? There's also um, a toxic love. Like I said, you got somebody here that is very toxic that is also wishing that more burdens get put on you. But justice is here. And justice don't put up with shit, okay? Karmic justice. This person that is casting shade at you, this narcissist, this empath, this person that is... Um, really trying to just wish that everything stay in the dark could also be doing some black magic moon rituals um god's got another thing for that ass okay yeah god's gonna help you move on and so is justice and you're gonna be moving on to another direction and i'm seeing another divine connection coming in for you okay libra um aiden Can you bring me my vape, please? Okay, Libra, let's see. Your angels are on your side, by the way. And yes, we are in the middle of healing some kind of childhood trauma. Okay. Justice. Thank you, baby. Come on. Okay, chunky cheekers. All right. Um, also, Libra, I don't know why I'm being told to do this, but yeah. There could also be something about dogs chewing up stuff. So make sure you pick up all your stuff, Libra. Okay, if you don't want the dog to chew it up, then pick it up. If you did uh, have something chewed up recently by a dog, this reading is for you. 
listen up buttercup because there's a message in here for you you're moving on to calmer waters to like i'm feeling like wealth and riches yep will of fortune okay you could also be dealing with a very significant pisces okay um this could be also bringing a lot of realization the tower card's not always a bad card okay it's a card of clearing foundation so you can step into your leadership power okay this is the card of leadership also, the card of what you think about, you bring about what you feel becomes real. So keep that in mind. Okay. All right. For my beautiful Libras. Anything else? Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, activate. Holy Spirit, activate. Ooh, that's nice. I like that. Okay. All right, Libra. Yeah. Holy Spirit, activate. Holy Spirit, activate. Okay. All right, let's see. We got a new financial beginning coming in, okay? Once you step into this leadership role, um, there will be um, news of financial success. You're gonna be recognized. Ooh, I got the hiccups. Okay, let's see, Libra, what do we got? What do we got for Libra? For Libra, for my beautiful Libras. Okay. Have you asked your angels for help with this? Your angels want to help you with this situation. However, they require your permission before they can intervene in your free will choices. All right, Libra, well, we need to ask. Ask and we shall receive. Also, we got mediumship. Yes, the collective of Libras that I read for are mediums. You have the natural ability to connect with, an connect with departed loved ones, okay? So if you feel like you're alone, you're not. And if you feel like you can't uh, get anything that you want in life, well, then manifest it because you have the manifesting power and skills, Libra. Okay? You're, use your spiritual gifts and natural abilities to attract your desired outcome. Okay? All right. One more for Libra. And I'm going to close it out because, yeah, or two more. Okay. And then law of attraction. You are what you eat, Libra, even spiritually. So make sure that you are feeding your soul. All right, my indigo, feed your soul, my indigo child. Okay, that's with singing and dancing and loving. And read books, start studying, start writing that book that you've been wanting to write or reading that book that you've been wanting to read. Um, yeah, or you could be selling, you could definitely sell some spiritual based books. Your life purpose evolves around writing, reading, editing, or selling spiritual based books. And then we also have here law of attraction. Relationships and activities that you once enjoyed are now changing as you become more sensitive and aware of energies. I love that. Okay. And cut your cords to the past, Libra. This negative toxic energy, this moon energy with this page of swords in reverse, you need to cut this out of your life. You need to do a cut cord cutting ritual or pray to your um, angels pray to God and ask God to just take it, take it away. Cut the cords, God, please remove this person from your life. And then it says, clear yourself. So you need to do a, a house cleansing. There's no reason why I showed you my, my cleansing rod. Okay. My cleansing wand. So you need to do a home cleansing Libra. Um, yeah. And we're going to go ahead and leave it there. If you guys would like a personal reading, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you would like a personal reading, please contact me on Facebook under Justice Healer. Okay. On Facebook, you'll see my picture with, uh, the moons in my hair. Okay. Um, also my readings right now, I'm all, I'm doing a special for full readings for $33 and 33 cents. Okay. Um, my twin flame readings are a hundred dollars or I'm sorry, a hundred and eleven dollars and eleven cents. And my emergency readings are a hundred and fifty five dollars and fifty five cents. All right, you guys. Well, if you guys like this reading, um, please don't forget to. If you care, then please share. And if you feel my vibe, please subscribe. I love you guys so much. I will be getting back on here to do um, Scorpio and Pisces. Scorpio and Pisces coming up next right at you. God bless. Love you guys.